Here's an arc length that responds to mouse movement. When you go left and right, the arc length changes size. So smaller is on the left, larger is on the right. And then when you go up and down, the whole shape changes size based on the up and down. Let me show you how. Start with an empty project in Game Lab on code.org. The first thing we'll want to do is draw a background and an arc, just like that. Okay, so these first two blanks are where we want it to start. It's X and Y position. Let's start in the middle of the screen. So that's 200, 200. And then the next two are its width and its height. So we'll just start with 50 and 50. And the next are where we want it to start and end. We'll just leave those alone for now. So that's what we've got. Maybe 100, 100. Okay. So let's give it some color, any color you like. And I'm going to go ahead and make my background black so it's easier to see. All right, so that's a 90 degree angle right there. You can change them right here to get different values. Now we need to make some movement. So for that, we're going to need a variable. And let's call, let's make two variables, one called size. We'll set it to 50, to 100. And now let's use that size variable right here under the width and the height. And the other one we're going to make is going to be arc length. I'm going to use a capital L. And we'll set that to 180 right now, and we'll put that in this last blank. So hopefully I haven't changed anything. Okay. So then we want to make these controlled by our mouse. So let's update the value of size with the mouse's Y value. All right, that's working nicely. And now we're gonna mess with the arc length based on the mouse's X value. Go back here and grab mouse X. This isn't going to be perfect. Let's try. The left looks pretty good, but the right is going a little too far. So on the X, let's say world mouse X times 0.9. Let's try that. Okay, so the left and right appears to be working just fine. Now the up and down appears to be working just fine. And the only thing that's different from this, from my uh, original one that I showed you, is I added an arc length on the drawing. I'm sorry, I added a stroke weight and a stroke color. You can make those whatever you want to. I think I did maybe 10 red. Chomp, chomp, chomp. That's it.